Hi, my name is Gopesh Anand and I'm an associate professor here at the University of Illinois and I'm an associate professor in operations management. I was born in India, uh, in Mumbai, India, and uh, here you see the Gateway of India in Mumbai. I completed my undergraduate education there in Mumbai, and then I came to the U.S. Uh, first uh, to study uh, in the MBA program, uh, and I came to Columbus, Ohio, uh, where I studied in the MBA program in 1990. So just to date myself, uh, uh, I was there from 1990 to 1992, and I got my MBA degree from uh, the Ohio State University, which is uh, there in Columbus, Ohio. And here you see uh, a beautiful picture of, of the skyline uh, of Columbus, Ohio. After completing my MBA, I returned to India and worked uh, in a business. Uh, we were uh, in a watch bands making business. Uh, I managed the business for nine years, uh, making leather, polyurethane, steel, and gold-plated bands. Uh, this is where I saw operations firsthand and learned about managing customers, ordering stocks, managing suppliers, keeping employees motivated. I learned about these things from a small business lens. I saw how scrap from making leather jackets and steel cooking utensils and recycled polyurethane were being converted using manual processes that gave small-scale businesses some unique advantages. I wanted to learn more about these things and had an interest in uh, teaching and research, uh, so I returned to the U.S. And I went back to Ohio State. I liked returning to a familiar place. I, I had been there before. Uh, and so I went back there in 2001. And, and uh, this time I was going back there uh, with my wife. So both of us uh, moved back to Columbus, Ohio. Uh, and there I worked on my PhD. Uh, related to my business experience, I got introduced to the idea of lean manufacturing. And I saw that it was to a great extent trying to run a large organization like many small organizations in a sense with daily problem solving and involvement of people. Uh, so I started studying continuous improvement initiatives, uh, and I studied that for my dissertation. Once I graduated from uh, The Ohio State University with my PhD in operations management, uh, I moved to uh, Champaign. Champaign uh, is a city uh, in, uh, in the state of Illinois, uh, and I got the opportunity to work here, uh, and, my also, uh, and my wife also had a nice job offer here, so we, we both of us got jobs and we moved here uh, in the year 2001. We've been here now for nine years in Champaign. Uh, here's a picture of the alma mater at the University of Illinois. Here I teach in the MBA programs. Uh, here's a beautiful picture of the, the quad, which is very close to uh, our uh, business school here. Uh, I teach in the MBA programs, both in the full-time as well as the part-time professional programs. Uh, here is the building in which we teach most of our MBA classes. Uh, this is the College of Business uh, building. The subjects that I teach are operations management, continuous improvement, and, and these happen to be my uh, research topics as well. So I've been studying this uh, as, a, as a PhD student, and I continue to study this uh, as a professor here as well. Uh, and here's a picture uh, of the atrium, uh, the beautiful atrium of the College of Business building at the University of Illinois. So uh, my life so far, uh, it has taken me uh, from a city of Mumbai, which uh, when I moved from uh, Mumbai in 2001, uh, the population there was 12 million. Uh, from there, uh, we moved to Columbus, uh, population 700,000, so uh, just about uh, three-fourths of a million. And uh, now we've moved to uh, Champaign, Illinois, uh, which has uh, uh, combining Urbana and Champaign, the Twin Cities, has a population of 120. So now we, we live here in this in the small town. So we've gone from a uh, 12 million uh, large city to a 700,000 city to a uh, 120,000 city. I have not traveled uh, internationally as, as uh, much as I would have liked. Uh, I've been to a few places. I've been to New Zealand. Uh, I've got some family that lives there, so I've, I've spent some extended time there. Uh, I briefly visited a few countries in Europe. I've, I've taught uh, in the executive program in, in Poland, uh, and I've visited as a tourist uh, a few countries there. But I haven't been to, uh, to too many other countries around the world as much as uh, my wife and I would, would like to travel. 
Uh, and, and that's why it's even more exciting for me to get this opportunity, to, to, to be in such an international group uh, of all the people that are taking this course from uh, different countries in the world. Uh, so I'm very excited to, to uh, hopefully interact uh, with, with uh, at least some of you and, and learn more about uh, where uh, you are and, and what kinds of uh, work you're doing and, and how you'll be using some of the things that uh, you'll be learning about in this course. In designing this course, uh, what I've tried to do is I've tried to recreate an in-class experience. So uh, although there, uh, there isn't any immediate interaction between you and me, uh, there's any, there isn't any in direct interaction between you and me, although we can uh, chat uh, through email and, and have some uh, online office hours, what I've tried to do is uh, I've tried to replicate the face-to-face the -face even in the class experience, so even in the sessions that, that you'll go through. I've tried to put in examples that you'll be able to relate to uh, from companies as well as from day-to-day -day life experiences. So hopefully you'll be able to relate to those as well. What you'll see in, in the sessions, what you'll find uh, as, as uh, hopefully value-added, is you'll see some pauses uh, for you to reflect on and apply some of the concepts uh, that you'll see here uh, to your experiences. And, and uh, I hope that you'll let me know what you think about the course. Uh, please be candid and frank. Um, I like to practice what I preach, so I would love to to hear from you, I'd like to apply continuous improvement, uh, process improvement to the course delivery and to the course content. Uh, so I would uh, uh, greatly appreciate your feedback. Your, your feedback is going to be very valuable uh, for me as uh, we, we move forward uh, with uh, improving the course, with, with developing new courses as well here at the University of Illinois. So please use uh, any of the multiple ways that this online medium offers uh, for sharing information about your experiences. Uh, and uh, your active participation uh, will make this more value-added uh, for everyone concerned. The team that's putting this course together and bringing it to you is, is really very excited uh, to, to get started on this. Uh, so welcome, and we hope that you're excited uh, to start with us on this journey.